We are reporting uh, from the city of White Marble, the capital of Turkmenistan, Ashgabad, where the Israeli Foreign Affairs Minister arrived in yesterday. The last time an Israeli Foreign Affairs Minister set foot on this country's soil was around 30 years ago. It was Shimon Peres, the late Shimon Peres. The Minister is meeting at the meantime the President Sardar Berdi Mohamedov, and afterwards he will be also discussing a few topics with uh, a number of uh, officials uh, from Turkmenistan, including the Agriculture Minister. And most importantly, in the afternoon, he will be opening the first Israeli embassy in this capital in Ashgabad, and he will also be meeting the Jewish community in Turkmenistan, even though this country is around 99%, consists of 90-90% majority of Muslims. And this is what actually making this visit special for Kohen and special for Israel. It is a country that is a Muslim country. It shares more than 1,000 kilometers of borders with Iran, the country that is considered the biggest threat to Israel's security. And uh, this country, Turkmenistan, along with Azerbaijan, the first country Kohen was visiting in this diplomatic trip, is or are considered, along with other Central Asian countries, as a new destination for Israel to influence and also to build cooperation and relationships and bridges with in order to uh, make a new era for both sides and to cooperate in many fields. This is what actually, and this is what precisely Kohen mentioned in the uh, in, uh, yesterday when he said that Azerbaijan and Turkmenistan are going to transform into some kind of a hub for Israel and a gateway for this region, the Central Asian region.